This is FYI on your TV brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham. I have got Perth Fire Chief Trevor Schofi with me. Thank you very much for joining us today. Hey, thank you for having me. And um, even more thanks for putting on a, an event for our children. We, you've got Kid Fish going on, the fourth annual Kid Fish. So let's talk about it. When is that happening? So it's happening on June 17th. It just happens to be the opening of Bass that day. So it's, uh, it's a big day for anglers. And, um, you know, it was, we're, we're pretty excited to bring it back. Um, there's a few groups that wanted to bring it back. It, it, was, it was held in Perth for many years. Uh, over 20, I believe, by a former group of volunteers. And it went away for a bit. Um, and we had a lot of public input saying we'd like to have this back. Um, so uh, we had a couple of members from our Drum North Elms Ate Valley Fire Department. Uh, I think they wanted to, to get it going. And we had some guys from the Perth Fire Department wanted it going. And the town said they'd help. So here we are in our fourth year uh, having a kid fish. So. Excellent, excellent. It just takes a few people uh, instigating something like this to get it started and uh, here we go again. So uh, it's yeah. wonderful. It's a, it's a great opportunity for children. So and uh, to get out and, and just enjoy the, the, uh, the activity of fishing. Yeah, and, and I think there's tons of things we want to keep kids active and you know some kids like sports and like the traditional ones like maybe hockey or you know physical exercise but then you can get into the different sports like angling where it's maybe it's not as physical but you know you're getting outside and you're doing something very unique and uh, it can be a lot of fun all right so you're, you're encouraging children with uh, in, uh, fishing rods and, and lures that sort of thing to come are you going to be able to provide any uh, fishing rods for children yeah we're gonna have uh, we're gonna have some worms on site I won't be uh, <laughs> touching them too much myself but uh, we'll help where needed um, so we're going to provide some worms and some, some bobbers if needed. Uh, we will have um, spare rods on site. Uh, we don't have many, but we're going to do our best we can to provide as many as we can um, for those that don't have them. And, I, you know, it's, it's always nice to have somebody there to help with the worms and to help with the, the fish. Putting the, it's a catch and release. You're putting them back in, yep. to throwing them back in. So it's always nice to have that, that bit of help, too. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have... Um, uh, one of our firefighters on site, he's a big fisherman and he'll, he'll be taking them and measuring them and you put them in the, a big aerator, you can watch them and then after we'll put them back in the water after we, we you know, we take a list. Excellent. Now, now this is, uh, our Perth Fire Department is helping out along with the, the town of Perth is, is helping and you're also doing it alongside uh, Tay, Tay Valley, One Res Fire Rescue and the Lanark County OPP as well. Yeah, OPP are going to help. Um, so it's, it's pretty exciting. They're going to come on board. Uh, there'll be some members of Ministry of Natural Resources uh, from the Learn to Fish program as well. Excellent, excellent. It's always nice to have these uh, programs for children to meet, you know, our, our firefighters and our, our police officers and our emergency service uh, people, you know, when it's not in an emergency. It's always nice for them to meet you guys. Yeah, absolutely. And just, you know, we're just normal people and it's, it's good to, you know, put a face or a name to the people that help and it should be a fun day. Oh, yeah, I'm sure there's a lot of children. How many children do you usually get out? So our, we range from 100 to 120. It's sort of a, a normal registration. Um, never been under 100. And one, 120 last year was our biggest uh, registered event. So it can get quite busy. Excellent. And this is going to be at the Legion? Is that where, where children are coming to register? Yeah, if they come to the Perth Legion, uh, they can register. It, it starts at 8 a.m. Uh, registration. Uh, and then you can register right up to 11, but we sort of stop the official um, measuring at 11.30 and we'll start lunch at that time. So you can come in, uh, register, it's free. Um, we take the name, the child's info, and then as they catch a fish, they can bring it up, we'll measure it, and then they can go back and catch more. Um, we do recommend you bring a pail or something to, to put the fish in to, to bring them if you're out in the basin side and you're walking all the way back. And there is a lunch provided, like you said, too. Yeah, we're going to have uh, hot dogs and a drink for all participants. Um, and then maybe even a Dairy Queen treat after. Nice, nice. Now, you've been here on FYI before to talk about the fire dogs. Can you talk a little bit about them again? Uh, sure. The, the fire dogs is a division of the, the Perth Firefighters Association. Um, and so their whole purpose is to, um, you know, create, create physical fitness activities for youth. Um, so we just recently had our major fundraiser our golf tournament last friday it was a it was a great day at the perth golf course um we raised over ten thousand dollars which is great uh, it was our 11th year doing it um so you had a hot day 
<laughs> we had a very hot day. Um, it was, yeah, it was a long, hot day, but it was a, it was a good day. Um, and, the, and the main purpose of that tournament is to raise money for public skating and public swimming. So in the town of Perth, uh, through the school year, every Saturday and every Sunday, we have swimming that's free for all on the Saturday and Sunday we have the public skating free for all. So that's the first mandate is to make sure that that's provided. Um, after that, if we raise more money that in addition to that, we could run other programs. So uh, we just also finished ball hockey at the Perth rink. So that's free for all kids. Uh, we had close to 200 kids registered this year uh, playing games every Monday night. Um, and we've done other things like uh, the pump track at Collin Farm. That was, we had $50,000 raised for that initiative and the town matched the other side. So we had a beautiful pump track installed. Uh, we've been able to, to put up new basketball nets at Conlon Farm. And then uh, most recently we created an outdoor pad, an outdoor rink at the fire hall here, um, which was another $100,000 initiative. So wow. um, it's pretty neat to see some of the stuff uh, that we can do. And it's all based on our community. Our community is super generous in sponsoring and, and helping and um, just, well, we've been doing this for 11 years, so it goes to show we're, we're still going strong. And they, they know the importance of it, so that's why they support you. It's a wonderful program that you do. So we've got yeah. Kidfish. It's going on June 17th from 8 till 12. You want people to come in, uh, children to start coming in and register uh, that morning of, or can they pre-register? Uh, Registration is only morning of, just okay. to keep it simple. Um, but, you know, we have had people come at 6 a.m., but you don't have to come that early. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime after nine, we'll start taking your names. And uh, yeah, we're, there's there's two divisions. We have uh, nine and under and, and a 10 to 15 age category. Um, you can be over 15 and participate. We probably won't, you know, you won't win a big prize, but you can still take part. Excellent, excellent. Well, it's, a, it's an event everybody's gonna look forward to. You get over a hundred kids, that's wonderful. Yeah, yeah. and the, the best part of the day is usually the strangest catch because you can sometimes get some interesting things coming out of the water. Oh, uh, what has been the strangest catch? <laughs> I, I think a fridge door was the oh, most interesting. I'm they thinking got a turtle paid. or a snake. <laughs> no, no. A bicycle tire. Yeah, they have, they have got a snake. Uh, yeah. Bicycle. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, that, that, that's fun. That's fun. Oh, look forward to it. June 17th, we've got Kid Fish going on in Perth again. Thank you very much for joining us today, too. We've got the uh, Perth Fire Chief, Trevor Schofield, joining us today. Good luck. Have fun. All right. Thanks for having me.